Good morning and welcome to Wednesday. We are focusing on dividing by two. As you can see, we have our white rose video, so feel free to get ready. And you can either begin on the starting screen and give that activity a go, or feel free to start on one minute 43. I suggest you stop at seven minutes 47 to then continue with my video, but feel free to continue if you so wish. A good place to end will then be on 11 minutes and 34. See you soon. Enjoy. Right, continuing into your books now, your tasks, thinking about what we have seen with our dividing by two. Also, we can see we have our multiplication symbol. Complete the stem sentences. I have cubes all together. There are, in each group, there are groups. Here is how you can see how you might do it within your books. Pop the date up there and give it its title. And then feel free to just use the lines to complete your sentences and fill in the missing numbers to match what you've seen and what you've written down. Do give that a go. Next, move on to this activity. Mo and Tommy have 12 sweets between them. They share them equally. How many sweets does each child get? There are sweets all together. There are groups. They, there are in each group. Here you can see an example of a bar model. Can you fill it in, fill in the missing parts and write a calculation to match? Do give that a go. Feel free to do it underneath your last bit of work. Once you've done that, move on to our next video for odd and even numbers. Because well as divided by two, we're also looking at odd and even numbers today. Now again here, like you know, feel free to obviously start from the beginning, which is great. Or if you want to just get to the let's learn activity, please go to one minute 56 to begin that. And an actual part to end will be on seven minutes 32. See you soon. Another activity for you to tackle will be spot the mistakes. Can you then make your own odd and even sets? It'd be good to see what you've come up with if you get the chance. Feel free to again lay it out in your book if you wish, odd at the top and even, draw them in. Maybe just circle those mistakes and add in any extra odd or even to the set, just to make it your own. Challenge to finish. Tommy says that when he adds two odd numbers together, his total will be even. Is he correct? Convince me. I look forward to seeing how you'll convince me. Right, do give those activities a go. Remember, feel free to use the maths notes that are attached, or if you want to just go back through the video, pause it on a page where you do your activity, feel free. Good luck with it all, and I'll come back in a minute with the answers.